Hey everyone, it's your girl Designer Soapbox and I am back with an educational video. Okay, so let's talk about pre-approval mail offers with Navy Federal. You know I love Navy Federal. I keep them coming. <laughs> so let's just get right into it. What is a pre-approval, okay? So basically when you are pre-approved for a credit card or you can also be approved for a loan or a mortgage, this is when a lender determines that you are eligible for a credit card. And this is also a soft inquiry, so it does not hurt your credit score. Okay, so this is really cool. Also, pre-approvals are usually automatic by the lender, okay? So it's different from pre-qualifying. Uh, usually when you're getting pre-approved for a credit card, those are automatic by lenders. Uh, for mortgages, is a little bit different. Pre-approvals still don't guarantee that you'll be approved. But the odds are really high because the issuer thinks that you have a good chance of being approved. So this is really key. So let's just dive right in. Should you apply if you get pre-approved? In my opinion, yes, 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 yes. Go apply. However, disclaimer, apply if needed. For me, I believe that uh, you should apply for credit as needed and if it makes sense for you, okay? I also mentioned in previous videos, don't go applying for a lot of credit in a short amount of time. However, when Navy Fed says apply, you're gonna wanna apply. Uh, it all depends on you as well. And these pre-approval come sometimes often, so if you miss it the first try, don't worry about it. When Navy Federal sends you an offer, go for it is what I, would do. However, a lot of people have got offers from Navy Federal and have not, you know, jumped the gun, which is okay. It's not like you're not going to get approved. This is just saying Navy Federal has, you know, pulled your credit with a soft inquiry. And they feel that right now at this time with your credit score that you may be pre-approved. So it does not mean that you're going to get approved again, but they really strongly believe that you can qualify for one of those products and services that they may have. So if you get a pre-approved mail offer, you will want to use the late night hack for better approvals in my humbling opinion. I just did a video on a late night hack. I'll link it right now on the right side of the screen and I'll leave it in the description below. But a lot of people have gotten uh, a lot of good results. I'm so happy that you guys are getting those results. Um, you know, I tried to find a lot of hacks for you guys to get you guys approved. So this may help if you do get pre-approved and you check that you have an offer from them, then use a late night hack for better approvals. Hey, it never you never know. It's just you want to just you know take it. You know you just want to. You never know. So also make sure you are alerted when Navy Federal sends you offers by mail. Okay, so you can also use. Use a USPS informed delivery app, which I use all the time. Uh, make sure you know you have your email alerted with Navy Federal. So whenever Navy Federal emails you, you are alerted. Okay. Um, also, make sure you check when you sign in online. There's an offer section that I have right here in the, the picture below in red where you see the offers in the red box. This is how you check your offers. So if you check your offers and you have an offer regarding any of their products and services, you never know. Go ahead and apply, um, you know, if need be. So a little bit of helpful tips for you guys. Keep in mind, pre-approval, they happen usually every three to six months for a lot of customers. Now, you may have been with Navy Federal for six months and you may never have gotten a pre-approval credit card, but you got two credit cards with them. That's okay. Uh, it's usually when, you know, they feel need be. So I'm not saying that everyone in Navy Federal will get a pre-approved pre offer, but it does happen around every three to six months, depending on who you are, okay? Also, be careful of pre-approval cards with high interest rates. So there's a lot of pre-approved cards. This is not with Navy Federal, but this is just in general. If you do get a pre-approved for cards, just be careful of the interest rates because sometimes when you get pre-approval cards they give you a, a kind of an interest rate 
and it's if, and if it's like really high, yeah, it's not worth it. Okay. Always apply for credit if needed, and if it makes sense for you. So just because I'm giving you guys information, I definitely don't want you guys to just you know go out and just apply for tons of credit. That's not ideal. I'm just giving you guys information so when you do feel like it's needed for you, you have this information available for you, okay? So uh, I want to highly stress that. If you have not received a pre-approval from Navy Federal, be patient with the process. I wouldn't, you know, I wouldn't say wait for that, but when it does happen, you are alerted now that you know, hey, you know, they feel like I have a great chance of being approved for a credit card. So I just want to put it out there in case some have gotten pre-approval. Some people have gotten pre-approvals and just, well, hey, they never apply or anything. So if you do get pre-approved, just look out for it. You never know. if And if it makes sense for you, go ahead. You can also still pre-qualify if you feel like you want to apply for a new credit card with Navy Federal. So if you have not gotten a pre-approval and you want to apply for a a credit card and you just like you know i've been seeing your videos designer so box i've been seeing everybody comments about them being approved but i just don't know if i will be approved you know go ahead and pre-qualify again pre-qualifying does not guarantee anything you can be pre-qualified for all of the cards and still get denied however my tip for that is to apply for the low tier cards which are the cash rewards and the platinum which are a highly a highly good card to get approved for when you're a new member. Now you may get a low limit if you're a new member. It all does, it all depends on Navy Federal. They they're just giving out money, right? They're just giving out credit whenever they need be. But from what I'm seeing is that a lot of people will get approved for those low tier cards at a high rate. Um and they get low limits, but that's okay. As long as you got approved for a credit card, you're in the door, you can work your way up with them. That's the good thing about credit unions, Navy Federal. You want to build relationships with them. So if you do pre-qualify and you're not sure about your credit score, you're not sure about your credit profile, or you're going through any repair process, try to quali- uh, apply for the low tier cards first. Now, there are some people that are brand new members and then apply for the AMAX and got 25K. Or there are some members that apply for the flagship and got 15K. You know, it all depends. I cannot tell you what Navy Federal will approve you for. But to be safe, you can apply for those low tier cards. And I guarantee you, you will get approved for a low limit. 500, uh, 1,000. You know, just be grateful that they approved you. And if they don't, try to do a secure card. So I talk about that in a lot of my videos. But I just want to reiterate if you have not watched those. But make sure you check out those playlists of my Navy Federal Credit Union playlist. Tons of game for you guys. Binge watch. You know, just get filled up with them. Hi, everyone. This is Anna Soapbox. I just wanted to make this video to guys let you know that I am having a 50% off sale for 72 hours. Yes, a 50% off sale on the 24 hour express anchor removal guide and also the late payment removal guide. So just head down to the description or to the pinned comments and click the link and get your 50% off. Remember, this anchor removal will help you remove hard inquiries from your credit report within 24 hours. And then the late payment guide will um, help you remove your late payments uh, very fast, super fast actually. Um, If you're tired of disputing your late payments waiting 30 to 45 days, this is a quicker method of getting these late payments removed. So if you guys enjoyed a lot of my content, I talk about this in my videos. However, I have this in an ebook. I'm doing 50% off for you guys. If you missed a 60% off sale, I'm doing one for 50% off. So I'll see you guys in the next video. And thanks for supporting. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment. Bye.
So thanks for watching. I really hope this content is really helpful for you guys. I love when you guys send me feedback in the comments. I love it. It keeps me going. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. Follow me on Instagram at Designer Soapbox. And check out those ebooks at www.designersoapbox.com. And if you want to become an affiliate, make sure you check that out as well in the links. And I'll check you guys in the next video. Bye. And don't forget, I love you all.